Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Enter the Gungeon. This is kind of just going to be a little bit of a random sit down. I just decided that I'm going to record something. And I just decided today I was going to play Enter the Gungeon. <clears throat> so this will probably be uploaded at some random part. I mean, 98% of the time, most of my stuff is uploaded at random. With the occasional, possibly like, two videos that I actually decide to upload and pick when I want them to go up. But, um... Yeah, it's just going to be another thing where I'll just kind of upload at random. It'll probably just be thrown in with all the stuff, so there might be a three video in, um, on a certain day, because this might just go up. <clears throat> but this is just kind of something, like I said, random. I just felt like doing something, something, you know, just, uh, just to have a little fun. <laughs> just something laid back, I guess. I don't really think I have anything kind of titled for this. <clears throat> like, uh, I don't really have anything titled like any sort of special series you know because i have things called like mini series and things like that but not this i do not all right thank god for the armor that started off poorly so if you ever seen this game it's a pretty interesting concept and you know i always like the the dungeon crawling randomly generated things i might actually play uh the other game that i have uh, Wizard of Legend, I think it's called, or something like that. We might play that at some point, too, because I played a bit of that. This I just literally started up, played like one or two games of, and I'm not quite sure of every function or everything, so. But I just wanted to do, sit down, record something. We're going to probably do this with certain, like, random games that I'll just kind of pick up and play. Might not really be a full-on series, or anything like that. Some of this might, end, in the end, be streamed as well, but there are times where I just kind of want to sit down, not stream, but want to record something. So. Today is just one of those days where we're just kind of chilling out, wanting to play. I mean, it's kind of like a little bit more laid back than the my usual. Like, I for the most part, I'm pretty laid back and chill about stuff, but there are times where I get a little bit hyper and excited about stuff, mainly when I have friends around. But when it's solo, it's a little bit more laid back. Um, but this time, it's a little bit, I, I feel like, is even more laid back than normal. Because I'm kind of just like, you know what, I just felt like hitting the record button on, on my uh, OBS and start up a game and just see where it goes, you know? Nothing crazy, probably wouldn't be super hilarious or anything like that, but you know, it's just some chill gameplay and... To be honest, I wanted to play this because I picked it up and I have not gotten around to touching it yet because I've been so distracted on like the other 90 things that I'm playing. But I do love just sitting down playing really random games, you know, like things that were either older games that they remat or, or just like brought over to newer systems might not technically be remastered, but they've ported over to just completely random games people may have never heard of. And sometimes it's the occasionally like good bad game where it's like it's so bad that you can't help but laugh and have fun at it. Uh, kind of like how when I played Kane and Lynch 2, um, for the first part of that game, it's really funny because you know you're just joking around, but when you're actually trying to beat that game on the hardest difficulty and stuff, my god, does that game become frustrating. What we got? Double vision and one for each of you. I don't know. I, I want my ammo drop. Just in case I really need it. Not that I really need it now. I got you can teleport. I kind of just end up running everywhere. I do not want to be near that grenade. Man, what a weird world. You know, walking grenades. They're almost as bad to me as the uh, suicide grunts in Halo games. Which, uh, funny enough, that's actually a series I still want to do. But I don't have an Xbox One, and I'm pretty sad that Halo hasn't, uh, hasn't been put on PC. Now, I don't know if my computer would actually handle playing and streaming at the same time. It's unsure. My computer's always very finicky about that stuff. But it would be nice.
Of course, you might be like, why didn't you get such and such? I don't really know what half the items do. I'm kind of, like I said, I'm winging a lot of this. But that's the fun of this. There goes my armor. Oh, tried to roll, didn't work. There we go. I'll use one of my keys and get it. What do we get? The Judge. I get it. Like the Judge Dread gun. But I'm always looking at it. I'm like, man, this older game might be a fun thing to record stream. But then what ends up happening is if I do find a gun. Or a gun. A game. And I, uh, I, I either just end up not playing it. Because of, uh... Because I already, like, have, like, 90 other things I want to play, or I'm already playing on stream, and I just don't sit down to record just on their own. I always end up just streaming a lot of stuff. Like, every game I pick up, I'm like, oh, this is stream-worthy. Like, I rarely have a game that I play on my own time that often. And that's a good and bad thing. I mean, I mainly focus on a lot of stuff going on in life that I don't uh, necessarily always have the time to play. Seems to be just causing all sorts of status effects. But yeah, like, I I, I, I kind of just like to stream everything, but I think the, the reason why I like doing that a lot isn't just because, you know... Well, the biggest reason, really, I like to stream everything. Um, is this... What do we got here? Blooper. Close your... Blue. Oh, okay. But uh, the biggest thing is just like if something silly happens, then I can. Uh, I have it recorded. You know, something hilarious happens because half the time it's just fun because it would suck to play things on their own when I do stream and record and then just have it miss out on stuff. Now, 90% of the time, nothing crazy or funny always happens, but still just that chance. I don't know people's strategies in this, if they would use their unlimited gun until something big happens and then switch, or just use whatever, you know. I still got my ammo robbed, so it's not a huge deal. But we have the armor. But yeah, I just like doing the things. That's why it's like, there's just so many games that like I haven't played. Jesus Christ! That I've just yet to play because I'm like, I gotta, I want to stream that because I think it'd be funny. But then what ends up happening is I'm so into so many variety things. Like I always have these like. And a lot of people have them. You get, like, addicted to a certain type of game, or you get, like, kind of a craving, in a sense, of that game. You just want to play this style, or this type, or maybe it's just that game in particular. And you can't help but keep playing it. Um, and that's what ends up happening with me, is I, I keep jumping because I keep wanting so many different games to play. Like, I just want to constantly jump into all sorts of different things. And so that's why I start, like, 20 different games up, and it, sometimes I end up not uh, finishing those games. Oh, God. Ooh, Jesus. Surprised they didn't hit me. Offering the rest is blank. Oops, walk away. But that's my problem. That's why, I like, certain games... Then there are certain games that aren't really holding my interest that I'll st I don't play as much, but I'm like, I feel bad because I do want to continue them. But then I just don't. Um, <clears throat> and some games just, in general, stop me. Uh, Final Fantasy XII, I keep always referring to that one. 
because uh, I was playing it, I was addicted, and I played a shit ton of it. And what ended up happening was I hit a kind of a brick wall where I have to grind. And I mean, it's Final Fantasy. You always have to grind. Nothing wrong with that. It's just the area that I hit is kind of a pain, and I was, I'm was i so distracted on everything else that I just hadn't had the patience to sit there and actually grind it. I know, I'm still alive. It's crazy. This is interesting. Jesus. What? I'm just gonna buy half a heart. On my way. Oh, there goes my armor. But that was one of the problems. Um, I, I've been pretty bad with uh, Pokemon games. But the problem with uh, what happened with that when I played Pokemon Black, uh, what was it, version 2, I think it was called, or something like that. Uh, my struggle with that was during the time all my friends wanted to play Payday and I wanted to constantly be involved in Payday. Two DCs. Okay. You know what? I'm down for it. I wish I had more health, because what we're going to go up against will probably suck. I don't have to offer this. But, uh, like, we, everyone wanted to play Payday 2 at the time when I was playing that and uploading a few bits of it. And, uh... And, um, so I just kind of stopped, and then I lost interest, because what happens is certain games, um, when I'm, when I'm too far off from them, like, when I stop, like, now Final Fantasy XII might be a little bit rough for me to get back into, but I might give it a shot at some point. But certain games like that, when I take too long of a break, the interest is just gone to want to go back to it. Now, if we're talking about games that I've started and stopped, like Prey... Um, it just wasn't hitting the buttons that of enjoyment for me. A lot of people love it. I didn't care too much for it, but then again, I felt easily overwhelmed, and I get overwhelmed pretty easily, and I think it was just one of those games that wasn't fitting my play style that I enjoy playing. And I might have been too much of a run-and-gun kind of guy at the time to uh, really sit there and try it. So maybe another time I might go back to it, but it's very hard to say if I will or not because of everything else I'm already doing. And if I'm not going to enjoy it, I'd rather not force myself to, and the people who are fans of it would rather not sit there and watch me complain about shit that's stupid because it's mainly my own fault why I'm struggling. Things like that. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn is a different, like, interesting thing for me. Um... When I first, uh... Interesting. I don't have a key for that. When, uh... When Horizon Zero Dawn, I started that. I was having fun with it. But what ended up happening was I was... I think I was playing that, and then... Altar is empty. I was having fun with it. But, uh, Ma I think Mass Effect distracted me. I think I started playing... I was playing that, Mass Effect, and Kingdom Hearts, and then I eventually just stopped because I was more interested in Mass Effect and Kingdom Hearts 1 at the time that I kind of just stopped playing Run Zero Dawn. <clears throat> um, so I didn't, uh... So I didn't, uh, keep playing it. I came back to play it. Got a little bit frustrated at times, but on my own playing abilities, I feel like I'm just not grasping things as great as I should be. I have a key for that, so we can't. So I kind of like am like wondering if I'm going to continue playing that or not. But all right, guys, hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. We'll uh, we'll tackle this soon, this uh, boss. We'll see if this run can stay alive or not. See you guys in a bit.